Hey guys, it's Queen Nisha, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 6 of Magic Over Clay. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Curl better make an appearance today. I would like for Curl to make an appearance. I mean, but shit. It's funny how some of the girls who already have are just playing God. <laughs> So, okay, hold on. We gonna skip the, the shit that happened last week with Kayere? I mean, I, I hope we're not. I mean, I would like for that to come back <laughs> into play because I have so many questions on that because of girl. <laughs> When is she going to make it up here? She's like the only one from the group. I mean, I think this is like the same thing because the memes that I've seen of her on Twitter. Oh my god. She's the only one who has not made an appearance in this anime yet. Mm -hmm. You saw it. <laughs> you saw it around. Oh, that looks so good. Yeah, it's a really nice house. So then that means that both her and what's your face, and maybe somebody else that they know, maybe sort of. Maybe you'll find girl. I mean, Jesus. We on six episodes now, and this girl has not made an appearance this episode of life.
This girl got a fucking hand. Something about this ain't right. Is it like what sparkling soda or something like that? I mean, it, it is water, but they could put something in it. But didn't you want to go something about that water? Mm -mm. Police is calling. Seriously? That's a little unfair, isn't it? Short and sweet, huh? Yeah, but she's that type of girl who's just like, screw it, I'm doing it on my own. Done. Seriously, with this toll? Exactly. So you don't really need to ask for money. <laughs>
No! Oh my god! <laughs> Bruh, I had a feeling she was gonna be in this episode. <laughs> And there she goes. Felicia, you are like extremely lucky as hell. I mean, you can run from nine 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 and nine and ropa. This child, are you freaking? <laughs> they would put the gear. <laughs> they just went meta in this. <laughs> I'm not even gonna get that luck. I kinda got lucky today. I got like a three star girl. She's pretty though. I just want my daughter to come home. Yeah, where are your parents? Do you not have any? Did they die? Oh. So that's why you're the way you are. You don't want anybody else dying. Freaking nacho style, like, oh my god, girl.
going to, but then you're going to go back more and more every single day. Mm-hmm. And they're on number 16. Yeah, but see, you won't say it's a rumor until it happens to you. And watch, it's going to happen by the end of this damn episode. Felicia going to disappear. Okay, that's fine. She can afford you. Yeah, like a nice home cooked meal. Yeah. Girl, well, you were the one who accepted it. Yeah, but you didn't. Sometimes you have to, though. You can't always go in guns blazing in this. This is why your teammates are so pissed at you. And they don't want to be around you. I like her though. She's very interesting, different though, but she needs to work with, she needs to learn how to work with others. I'm already getting fucking monogatity pills with this episode. We're at 13. Even though it's by the same people who made the damn show, but my god. I just want to expect a current. Hit it!
I think that's what I should say here. And of course, she's going to say yes in a heartbeat. temptation holy shit oh my god she looks like Shana Boo <laughs> you give someone something and they'll do anything no matter what but still I like her she's interesting I just feel so bad for her out of like she's I, what did I I got her I think the first week the game came out and I thought she was interesting, still is, but I never would have thought that her parents would have died, like, gotten killed by a witch. Like, damn. But this is a girl who seems, I don't want to say desperate, but in a way, what, what she's doing, she does seem a teeny tiny bit desperate with it. To getting revenge. Now, the three girls in black, I was assuming that they were, because there's just one girl who also uses the name Kuro in the game. She is literally in the exact same outfit that those girls are wearing. It's more of a purplish, blackish color. She hasn't shown her face, but she's very mysterious as well. And I want to know more about her. And I immediately thought that was her, but the, there's three. So now I'm wondering, who is this Magnus person? It's got to be someone. Don't know who, but I got a lot of questions about it. And I feel like now, because of this, Felicia is going to turn on them. All because she wants revenge on witches and to kill them for the fact is that those witches killed her mother and father. I mean, yes, you can't get your parents back for that, but like, uh, I don't, I don't know. I'm, I'm so confused. I'm upset too, but like, oh my god, she just seems so freaking precious. But because of the fact that it's like all her luck, it's gonna run out in this next episode. Because, I mean, girl, girl, oh my god, this one. <laughs> I'm tired. I'm fucking tired. Oh my god, baby. Something's gonna happen in this next episode. I do love the fact though, um, it, it's like. Watch your face. I, I, Cause I feel like every single time I say her name wrong, so I'm not even gonna try. Um, I'm glad that she came. I had a feeling she was gonna come in this episode because. Mommy came, and I was like, I feel like they're gonna go down, they're gonna go backwards, or maybe forwards, or whoever. Madoka is gonna be the last one who's gonna show up in this show, no matter what. So I'm guessing she's gonna appear. This is now what episode six, and apparently someone has told me there's gonna be thirteen episodes for this show. So I feel like Madoka is going to make an appearance between twelve and thirteen. They're going to stretch it out as much as they can, just to be like, oh hey. She's coming, like, don't, don't you freaking worry, she is coming. I do love the fact that they literally made the game come in this episode. I, I was, like, I wasn't expecting it, it, but it just made it, like, that much more meta. <laughs> and shit, I mean, like, Danganronpa has made some meta moments, especially with its last game, but just this episode overall, and how literally she's there playing the DM game. They ain't show everything, but, like, literally doing a gotcha, and then you seeing the numbers go down, which last one was at, like, it went from 17 to 16. That was interesting. I would have, like, honestly, that was the biggest thing besides what's her face being in this episode that fucking surprised the shit out of me. But I don't know. I mean... I hope that Felicia, you know, whatever's going to happen in the next week, she's already made her decision. She's going to say yes no matter what. But I just hope that the decision that she's making, it's the right one for her. It seems like it may be for her at the time, but then to me, it feels wrong. There's going to be a consequence that's going to come with taking, saying yes to these three, like, people, women, girls, magical girls. I'm going to consider them magical girls until we know who the fuck they are. And this Magnus person, whoever the fuck he or she is, I'm gonna, I'm guessing it's going to be a girl. It has to be because what if it's freaking Kuro? Kuro, eh? Because, I mean, seriously, we haven't seen Kuro eh, since episode one and this girl is MIA and you sitting here wondering when the hell this girl is going to make a damn appearance and she still hasn't made a damn appearance. You're wondering where the fuck this girl at. So, I don't know. 
Because she got a lot to explain, like, where the hell she has been and my AF in this bitch. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 6 of Maggie Got Recorded. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join my squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for episode 7. Bye, guys. Thank you.